a couple of pastors and a church are being expelled for their support for gay marriage. That's right, the Evangelical Covenant Church, the covering that's over many churches around the country, they have expelled First Covenant Church in Minneapolis along with their lead pastor from being able to operate anymore under their covering. Now, they'll still be able to operate as a church, but they're not going to be a part of the Evangelical Covenant anymore, any longer. After word got out that they were supporting gay marriage, not only supporting gay marriage, but that also they officiated a wedding for a lesbian couple back in 2014. This is from the lead pastor. He officiated this. And that they also teach on the fact that, hey, there's nothing wrong with LGBT rights. They teach it's all about love and inclusion, that homosexuality, it's not wrong whatsoever. Well, a vote was made as they were holding a meeting in Omaha, Nebraska. They voted 77% to go ahead and ban this pastor and the church. They're being kicked out. Now, not only that, but also a Michigan pastor as well was expelled. So they, they targeted quite a few people here. A Michigan pastor was expelled for him also officiating the wedding for his gay son back in 2017. So a lot of controversy here. A lot of members responded. Now, the lead pastor of the church in, in uh, Minneapolis responded by saying he was disappointed. He's been a pastor since 2009, about 10 years now. Very disappointed, but he understands that that's the decision that they've made and he's going to have to live with it. He didn't take anything back for what he's done. I mean, whatsoever, he's going to continue believing what he's believing and preaching what he believes, even though it's completely wrong and it's completely against the word of God. Others in the community have also condemned Evangelical Covenant for their decision to expel the church and its pastor from being able to continue. So I think this is a good move because I think that more churches need to take some responsibility. They really need to do the right thing and not allow these churches to be under their umbrella if they're going to be promoting homosexuality as if it's not wrong, as if it's not against the Bible. It's what we need to do. They need to be held to a higher account because that's what pastors and leaders are going to be held to. When they are judged before God one day, they will be held to a higher account maybe than you and I are. So I think they did the right thing here, but I want to hear from you guys. What do you think about the expelling of these pastors and this church? Let me know. Do you think it should happen more often too? Let me know about that. Sound off down below. If you enjoyed these videos, please consider giving them a like and a share. Also subscribing here if you are new. I greatly appreciate all of your support. Thank you so much for spending a couple of minutes of your day with me today. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. God bless each and every single one of you, and I will talk with you soon.